Well, if I were Francis Collins, of course, I'd come up with a song, but limited as I am, my staff thought this might do. "'Twas the night before retirement, and throughout Building One, not a scientist was stirring. All the research was done. The microscopes were nestled away in the lab. After 12 years of work, there was no more to be had. The goggles were hung in the cabinet with care in hopes that Francis Collins soon would be there. Francis made great discoveries, served three presidents, found the gene for Huntington's, and away disease went. He mapped the genome and funded CAR-T. He hired 21 IC directors, but none were Fauci. He tackled the brain and cancer moonshot. He targeted medical challenges and hit the right spot. He came to the Hill with great success. NIH funding increased, and he said, thank you, God bless. Then 2020 came along with COVID-19. Let me take a moment to set the scene. The world was on lockdown. We were confined to our homes, but that didn't stop Francis from studying chromosomes. He continued to work, socially distanced from all. When he logged in on Zooms, they'd ask, why not a call? He told them of breakthroughs. They said, you're on mute. He had velour track pants on beneath his blue suit. Then, more rapid than reindeer, with warp speed they came. NIH researchers celebrated and shouted their names. Now Pfizer, now Moderna, create a vaccine. Use medical research to end quarantine. Flatten the curve, send the message to all. Slow the spread, slow the spread, and COVID will fall. These years have been hard. Francis is due a vacation, but the thing he wanted most, emergency use authorization. Come on, Team Francis said, we have a great opportunity. If we vaccinate more, we can reach herd immunity. Due to his leadership, we become COVID wiser in hopes that we will all be protected by something like Pfizer. We've had treatments and vaccines, and thanks to research, Francis led us to many, from atop his high perch. As Francis' tenure at NIH draws to an end, we must say goodbye to one of the best of our friends. And I know he'll exclaim as he and Diane drive out of sight, good luck to you all, keep up the good fight.